of here. This is a get ready with me. I thought I would do two looks with this first, but no. I'm going out today. No one's going to go out today. Um, me and my husband, we're going to try to get a washer and dryer for our new house. <laughs> so, okay. I'm going to do one look. Uh, I love this palette. I'm so glad that this palette actually came out. I haven't tried it yet. But I'm so glad it came out because no one really put out winter palettes or Christmas palettes. Only saw like one Christmas palette. And brands are already starting to put out spring palettes. It's like, oh, forget winter. Forget Christmas. It's like, what? <laughs> but anyway, I, this is a very winter palette. This is a very winter colors. It's like icy colors. So that's cool. I like that. Hopefully it's a good formula. I've been seeing mixed reviews on it. Um, but I think I'm going to, I don't know, I have very dark hair. I'm on Tarasha Yuga Baby Glue. I think I'm going to go to, um, well it's almost Christmas. So I'm just going to do a green. How about this? I'm just going to go to this one and this one. And do that. That's what I'm going to do. I wish they had a lighter green. They have a lighter shimmer green. Um, but they don't. So I'm going to have to work with what I got. Okay. Okay. So, let's do Jacket Hill Morphe brush. I'm going to go into this one. Uh, if you don't know that uh, pretty much every single palette that um, ColourPop puts out are magnetic, so you can take them out. There's, there's very hard to do so. A lot of people don't know that. And when I point that out on my YouTube channel, they're like, they're not magnetic. And then I have to prove it. <laughs> yeah, they are. They're magnetic. Okay. I think that's cool. Okay. This is be very similar to the look I had on yesterday. <laughs> But I'm just going to put this all over my lid, use it as my base, and um, put the shimmer on. So it seems to be blending okay. This is what palette got mixed reviews. Some said they hated it, some said they, they were in love with it. I'm in love with the color scheme. I, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna think I'm gonna use this a ton during the winter because it has everything I need for the winter season. Okay. So I was very excited when I saw this. This is so cool. And I was so glad I was able to buy it. Because I'm not always able to buy everything I want. So. Hopefully I have the funds for the Sage palette. I really want that one. I'm Wicked. And obviously I have a special relationship with Sage. So. Okay. I think it's gonna be so easy. I, I like it. I um a lot of color pops um shadows kick back a lot and I hate it. But they blend okay. This one's not doing that at all. So that is cool. Okay. And it's really clinging onto the brush too, because when I do this I don't really get anything. I gotta tip it off and nothing comes. So it's really clean to the brush. So that is cool as well. So Okay. So so far this green is pretty cool. Okay. Okay. Hold up shades. I don't like it when it's too much color right away because it comes over overwhelming. It really does. So. Okay, I'm gonna go with the smaller Morphe brush. This is also Jaclyn Hill. And just go over this. Okay, this brush is getting on my nerves. Okay, um, I'm gonna go to this. This is Morphe, um, Disney collection. Okay, cool. As you, know, as you can see, if you hate building up shades, you won't like this palette. I'm, I'm having a feeling. 
but if you like it, you like blending shades, you'll like this. I forgot to put my primer on. I just remembered that. So let's see how it holds up with no primer. <laughs> this one here. I, yeah, I like that. That's cool. Okay. It blended in there pretty well. Yeah, it's blending there pretty well. But more I play with this, more I will know about this palette. Okay, let me just mix these shades together. But it's not taking me too long to build them up, but you definitely have to build them up. But I love that it doesn't kick back as much as their others do. I think that's right. I just hope I like it. I really do. But I'm not going to lie to you. Because that's... Uh, the color palette's not painting me, so why should I lie? <laughs> I mean... So this is a review. Yeah. You definitely have to build up the shades. So what I did is mix for my back color to do my halo. I mix this one and this one together. I'll say it again, this one and this one together. Okay, I'm gonna put on my shimmer because I think it, I think it's like it's not clean to it. It's clinging to the brush, but... Okay. It's... It took me 10 minutes so far. It's not bad. Okay. Okay. I'm feeling this shimmer. Some say there are press glitters in here. I don't see press glitters. I just see shimmers. But okay. Oh, this is smooth. Okay. Okay. Oh, that was beautiful. Okay, I really like this shimmer. It's really pretty. Okay, I'm gonna use my other hand. It is really pretty. Okay. Oh, that is gorgeous. And how an easy guy on there, too. It's so easy. Okay. And if I decide I don't like the bats in here, well, it would be that way horrible because they're so pretty. Um, this shimmer right here is fantastic. It's, it, this thing is blowing my mind. Okay, I'm gonna take a little bit more. I mean, brush here. I'm trying to make sure my eyes covered. Just so you know, this is with no primer. I didn't get much fallout from the shimmer at all. So that's incredible. Okay. And I really like how it's easily blending like with no effort at all into the shadows. Like it's so easy. So if you just buy the palette for the shimmers you will be very happy.
and this eye is going on better. I always have a bad eye and a good eye and they switch. I think it's because sometimes I, I dry, an eye is drier than the other. I think that's what's happening there. But no effort at all. And it like immediately blend into the freaking eyeshadow. It's like butter. Okay. Mats, I don't know about. I that mat was okay. It was a terrific. But I just that just one mat, and I got it to work. So in ten minutes. He's already doing my corner on his own. <laughs> cool. That is really cool. Okay. And they have beautiful purple shimmers too. Hopefully they're just as good. Cause I love purple. Um. Hopefully they're just as good as the um others. So. Okay. I'm gonna do my foundation. Put primer on this time. Very happy with the shimmers. Like, it's static about the shimmers. The shimmers are really pretty. Okay. They're little. This is a um, primer for, um, it hides your um, pores. Pretty good. I need to wear more of it. So. This is, um, they say it's a light coverage, it's tinted moisturizer, but it's, it's medium coverage. Okay. I have dry skin, so I need something like this. Kind of dewy. But sometimes my skin is so dry, not even this works. But. Okay, this is a palette I got from my mystery box. So I'm gonna try this. Um, I think I'm gonna try this peach one here. Yeah. The peach or pink? I don't know. Okay. Oh, this is kind of purple. I'm gonna swatch them. This one's kind of purple. A little bit. I thought it was brown. This is pink. See it? Hmm. I'm darkening up a little bit more. I think this would also look good as a shimmer. I can't see it. Okay. I can really see it on my, my hand. You, but you can't see it on camera. I'm just not picking it out. The camera doesn't want to pick it up. Okay, there it goes. Work good with this green I got going on. So. I'm not sure I like the Tyler. It's very chunky. My kid is grooming for me. I don't think I like this highlighters. I mean, I'm gonna try the darker one. Ooh. I think I like the darker one better, actually. It really goes on there. But I'm gonna have to go finishing powder over it so it doesn't look like a bruise. Yeah, it's really go. Okay, cool. really blended out. I may have to take this off. It may be too much. Okay. My kid's hauling for me. Okay. Yeah, it's a nice contour shade here. Let's turn it down though.
I think that was too much. For other people, it would be fine for them. I think. But. But I turn it down. I think it'll be fine. She is not having it. Almost done, baby. Okay. Definitely got enough blush on. Yeah, these are a little different. They're not too much of a shimmer. This was more like a contour purple. Like a blush in like a bronzer in one kind of thing. Color for me. Okay, okay I'm gonna go with this blue underneath my eyes. with this brush. I'm going to have to hurry up because she's not happy. Just blend it out better. Okay. A little bit of this um, shimmer here in my corner. A little small brush because it was working really good. So. so they work really good as a highlighter too I guess if you, make, if you use a little bit of it. That was too much blush, I don't know. Or maybe I'm just insecure, I don't know. Okay. Okay, and I'm gonna go back over it underneath my here to kind of set this in a little bit. Okay. With finishing powder right underneath my brow bone so it just so it just sets in better it feels like it just it feels like it's not like just on top okay you put it around here So I think that's good. Mm. 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 I'm gonna do a nude in Jeffree Star. Okay. Yeah, I think that is it. I think this looks okay. Hopefully it does. <laughs> okay. And so this is the palette. I use this one, this one, and this one. So making my mind up about it. So making my mind up about this. So. But anyway. Um, thank you so much for watching. Have a, have a great day.